Hello, welcome to One Moment Wiser. This is Christy Bridges, and I was thanking God for the Saturday I had. It felt like a vacation. And then I started thinking of all the things I did on Saturday. I woke up at 4.30 and took a friend to the airport. And I came home and wrote some letters because I was wide awake. And then I went and hung out with a friend of mine at the gathering place. And I checked submissions for Option Ocean and got excited and shared those. We went to lunch, came home and hung out with the hubby, went for a hike, went to the jazz night at the um, Tulsa Air and Space Museum, fantastic, and then went out to dinner and came home and watched a movie when my husband got off work. If you had said ahead of time, Christy, I have all these things that you need to fit into your day, I never would have gotten out of bed. My first instinct would have been to think of all the things I wasn't going to get done that were on my list of to-dos. And then I also would have thought, how will I ever fit this time in? And I would have felt so stressed. But instead, because I had a couple of those things planned, and then I allowed myself the freedom to enjoy the day as it flowed, I felt free like I'd had a vacation. Totally different experience, all due to perception. So King David in Psalm 102, three and four, he was running for his life. And he said, my days vanish like smoke. My bones burn like glowing embers. My heart is blighted and withered like grass. I forget to eat my food. Now he was running for his life, but we're racing the clock a lot of times. And the stress of that can actually affect our bodies the same way the fear and adrenaline was affecting his. So let's realign. Go to God. Say, Lord, you are in charge of this day. Help me to stay aware of you and to flow with you. In Jesus' name, God bless you.